Okay, welcome back to Let's Play NES Remix. Excite Bike is one of the highlights of this collection, so let's check it out. First, um, we're gonna get a tutorial on how to play the game. It's easy to play Excite Bike. All you have to do is, well, according to this tutorial, just hold A and get to the finish line. You gotta watch out for mud. There's gonna be mud here. There it is. It's muddy. The uh, stadium crew failed to clean. They failed to do their job. But, um, oh, and also there are obstacles here. Go away. I am the Excite Bike Rider, and I'm gonna do a wheelie and not fall over because I'm too much of a badass to do that. So, oh god, that guy just flipped right over. Uh, this is very easy, very fun. This is <laughs> not a challenge yet, but they're gonna get challenging, let me tell you. It's exciting. It's thrilling. It's Excite Bike. Okay, now it's gonna tell us how to do a wheelie. Do a wheelie! Oh yeah, you can actually fly back if you screw up your wheelie. You can fall over. You do not want that to happen. Oh, and this is a very cool technique that I actually didn't know until I played NES Remix. And that's if you wheelie over an obstacle, you will not crash. You'll just pass right through it. But you gotta get the timing down or else you will fall flat on your ass and you will basically look like a dumbass. Like that. There, that's how... That's how you not do it. That's, that's, don't do it that way, basically. So up, up, and up, up, up. Timing, yes. <laughs> it's wonderful. It's exciting. It's the rainbow, triple rainbow Sunday Supreme. It is time for stage three. Okay, here's the trick. Here is the secret to going fast and getting fast times in Excite Bike. You need to land completely perfectly on both wheels. Both wheels have to hit the ground at the same time. It's different from a, a different biking game that I play. Uh, Trials, Trials Evolution and Trials Fusion on the Xbox 360. Very great games. But, um... In the Trials games, you want to kind of land on your back wheel slightly before landing on your front wheel. In this game, you want to land on both wheels perfectly. Get the best speed. Oh, and here's the last mechanic. If you hold B, you can activate your turbo and your temperature meter will go up. You run over some arrows, your temperature meter goes back to normal somehow. Um, it's gotta be some sort of future technology that the Excite Bike universe is keeping from us. But um, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna get mad about that. You know, if they want to keep their their engine magical engine cooling arrows to themselves, well, I guess they can do that. Now we're gonna put all of our skills together and complete a lap on track one and I can actually tell you about my the history that I have with this game I first played Excite Bike <clears throat> um, I must have been five or four years old I can't remember uh, one of my cousins brought it over and it was just I was blown away it's like I, I can't really see anyone being blown away by these by this game like these days, but back in the late 80s, this was pretty fun. Uh, my cousins used to bring over this game, and Contra, and sometimes Gauntlet, and I would just have a blast just playing them. It, Excite Bike is really good too because it has a level editor, and uh... In this one, you have to knock over a rival with your back wheel. It is a very, very evil maneuver because, well, first of all, 
you're cheating to get ahead. So basically, you're playing Tour de France style. And second of all, that guy takes a mean tumble. Look at that. He falls over. His bike falls over with him. It's a wonder he's not breaking any bones. Okay, now it's gonna get a little bit difficult. Or maybe not. I don't know. We gotta get to the finish line without crashing. And every, every single one of these... People who are, like, in front of me, they are, they are determined to get in my way. They are determined to change lanes without warning. They are determined to basically make my life as hard as it <laughs> needs to be. <laughs> so, you got two purple riders, a blue rider, and they're both just like, they're not even keeping in their lane, so I have to, I have to get away from them. Don't you even think about it! Oh god, I'm gonna fall. I almost died. It's the erratic bikers of Excite Bike. Alright, <laughs> moving on to stage 8. Okay, beat the third best time. The best time is on the uh, on the board in the background, minute 16. It's actually not... I don't think it's that difficult. But um, the cool thing... Oh, damn it, I fell. The cool thing about these Excite Bike challenges is that they pretty much all come from, I believe, the first track in the game. And if you buy the, the actual like game of Excite Bike, it comes with something like... I don't know how many tracks it has, at least five. Oh god, this is a two-lap level. And it still holds up today, in my opinion. So, buy Excite Bike in any way you can, if you want, I guess. <laughs> Alright. Should we run over someone with the back wheel? I'd like to, because it's funny. No, oh, you will never make that room. That jump. Don't hit me. Oh god, I almost ran over that guy. I think you... I think you... fly off your bike or something if you... try to run over someone who's... not on their bike, like they're running to their bike. I think you just crash. But hey, I won. I got the victory celebration. I got three stars. I'm going to pin them on my jacket and be cool. Stage 9 out of 10. Can't believe we're almost done with Excite Bike. Although this challenge could give me a little bit of issue because, like, once again, I have to complete a lap without crashing, but I can't do it very easily because you have all of these, these biker guys determined to get in my way. He's gonna change right into my lane and, and, and hurt me, uh, that blue guy, please go away. This is terrifying. Did you see that? Did you see what happened? That blue guy, or that purple guy slowed down on purpose. He must have. So I'm gonna hurt you. I'm gonna send this guy to the hospital. Uh, should I send anyone to the morgue today? Mm, not today, I'm feeling generous. Okay, run over the magical engine cooling arrows. Please go away. Oh, man. I just want to get away from everyone as fast as possible. And it's good that I only had to do one lap. Because two laps would have been pretty hard. And hey, my bar is almost at the end. Final Excite Bike Challenge. Let's go. Is this beat the best time? It's just you and the track, and your skills, and your noggin, and your thumbs, and your eyes, and your brain, and your reflexes, and your Wii U gamepad, or your NES controller, and the track, and your cooling arrows, and your long jumps, and your dips with grass, and your ramps that go up out of nowhere, and your dirt that makes no sense because the janitors didn't clean anything, and your bike 
and your engine and your motor and your gas that's overpriced and that guy waving a flag and that other guy supervising the guy waving a flag and that third guy supervising the fourth guy who was waving the flag and the audience and the announcer who's on vacation because that's why he's not saying anything and your wits and that's what Excite Bike is all about. Try the next track by buying the full game. No thank you. So, that was Excite Bike. That was three stars. That was a perfect run. And that was pretty fun. Next up, it's time for Balloon Fights. Next time on NES Remix, Balloon Fights. I'll see you next time.